Welcome back to our channel. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Your time. Thank you for your continued support. Please subscribe to this channel if you haven't turned on the bell so you do not miss when we upload new video and most especially you don't miss our giveaway by the end of the month. Okay, guys, in the video of today, Fauci is a man that has always spoken out his mind, pardon me. And today he says that the president is afraid he's not capable of being Nigerian president. If not, he should be able to stay longer and address the people. Please watch and let me know your thoughts below. Please watch. The general spoke for 70, 57 minutes in his entire tour of Nigeria. In his entire tour of Nigeria, 36 states, he spoke for 57 minutes. How can you want to be president of Nigeria? You are ashamed, afraid to come and do a debate. In a country so, so, so enlarged, so, so, with, with people with intelligence. That means General Buhari will end up as a shield for some people to corner the Nigerian economy. I want to analyze this very briefly, and it's in the public domain. I am one man that is not afraid to tell you as it is. You can only throw away my word, you can't do nothing to me. <laughs> Lagos State and in IGR, it gets about 300 million. Lagos State, million equity, about 300 million equity a month. Lagos gets about 30 billion. When you enter Lagos from Baja, my sister, my brothers, just look straight. Oh. If you look at the inner roads, you will miss it all. 36 billion will take care of 12 states in Nigeria conveniently. And take away the investments of a federal government in Lagos, you will see is a shell. Take away all the bridges done by the past administrations, the military, imaginarily take them away. You can only measure performance by the availability, what is available to an individual to develop. You can't measure it when somebody is plus IGR plus allocation 40 billion. And that person is telling us he's performing. Performing what? Let me again disagree with my brother who said the position of the governor's forum is that they are not contesting the age of General Buhari. I'm different. This one is my own opinion. Todd Dillo Spencer. This is my opinion. A man who becomes a judge have a terminal day to leave the place. A permanent secretary must go at 65. At 60. A, a, a pilot has the number of hours you can fly. And the age you cannot cross. Are you telling me those things were not well thought of when they took those sections? Because they know your mental capacity will be diminishing every day. A lot of people who are over 70 are now wearing pampas. What are we talking about? Nigerians must not be misled. They must vote for people... Sorry, sir. They must vote for people that have the capacity, mental ability to do this job. As a governor, I don't sleep. As a governor in Nigeria, I don't sleep. I barely sleep five hours. I barely sleep five hours because this one will complain. And when I don't have the money, I must have good mouth to balance it. <clears throat> for, for a long time, I have, I have one thing this my brothers don't have. One thing they don't have, I have. I was governor before them. I serve in the then regime. And I've joined them now. So I have the... You get it. <laughs> that is why everything I'm saying to you, Nigerians, General Buhari, is too old. It's not personal. If you have picked Kakwaso now, Kwankwaso, our brother. It's our brother. 
we know this one has life in his body. You will not see such a president maybe once in two weeks. Because he'll be too tired. He cannot be overstressed. Except that person is taking something to, to you know, the president of Zimbabwe. One has to be careful. Uh, I want to round up because I don't want to waste your time. You want me to stop? I will soon round up now. Last week, this last Saturday, I saw Legosians jogging or running all to prove a point to cover certain tracks, I say. But our own Jonathan jogging, we can see the man who wants to be president, the life in the man. Let them bring our brother to joy, our father. <laughs> Let us bring, them, bring him. If this mission... Yes, if this mission is not to corner Nigerians, Nigerians' wealth and tax them to bleeding. Today, in Lagos, people are crying under the tax laws. The Okada riders are now jobless. I was, I was, uh, I want to remember a case of Zambian president a few days ago. The opposition raised issues about his health before the election. They were complaining this man is not okay. The man fell two days ago now. He told that go operation. That one will not happen in Nigeria. I was driving through Lagos. And I saw the pictures of General Buhari. That is not General Buhari. Oh. Those pictures in Lagos. Because you can't tell me that the same man 20 years ago. That picture is a man 20 years ago. My picture when I was 30 years and now. The identity of two different people. If you want to enter UK like this and you bring such picture, they say, this is not General Buhari. That is deception. That is photoshopping. That is clean up, foundation. When you put foundation, <laughs> my sisters can tell. A man that is sick is sick. No other name. And I want to read just this part before I go. The journey, the four years in the life of a man looks, appears long. Or in, in the life of a nation, it's not long at all. It's not long at all. For that nation to err on the path of caution. We enter this Wahala because Baba Basanto was calling, Umoru, Umoru, I, they say you are sick, are you okay? May God help us, you. This one is not a death wish, it's a reality wish. This same situation, the North, the North must exercise patience of four years and don't want a reversal of yesteryears. This is a banana, ba banana peel. Banana peel on the floor that can be very me me messy. God forbid, bad thing. So that the journey of four years will not become the journey of 40 years. It is avoidable. Jonathan has spent four. Concluding his four will give not that expressway of eight years rotational presidency. <laughs> Whose interest is being represented when you are forcing office on a man who does not have the capacity? Health is of great importance. The other things about poverty, my brothers have said that. I don't want to repeat it. Another thing I saw in Lagos, in the advert, one meal per day. Ah, this, one is, this one is lies. It's lies. Lagos has been earning these huge resources. They cannot give one meal per day in Lagos. Is the federal government that will come and give one meal in my state? Is that possible? One meal per day. This is lie. You are lying to Nigerians. I want to please remind us to tell our people at home that it's time for everything under the sun. It is time for Jonathan to conclude this assignment and it will come to pass. Thank you very much and God bless you.